New details tonight on a story we first brought you on Eyewitness News at 6. The search continues tonight in Providence for $20,000 that went spilling into the street. Now it happened after the back doors of an armored truck just popped open and then bags of cash went flying. Eyewitness News reporter Perry Russell has the new details for us tonight live with the Providence Mobile Newsroom. The missing money report was given to police eight hours after it happened and after the company realized they were missing a lot of money. If you've seen $20,000 lying on the streets of Providence, you are kindly asked to give it back. I don't know what I would do. It'd be like, pick it up and keep on going. <laughs> Providence police tell us just before noon on Wednesday, a Brinks armored truck was pulling into the main entrance of Rhode Island Hospital on Eddy Street. That's when the back door of the truck flew open and three bags of money fell out. Two were run over by a car, sending money flying into the air only to be swept away by the wind. I probably tried to grab as quick as possible, you know, and put it in my pocket, you know, grab a bag or something. The armored truck was parked and the crew closed the door trying to pick up as much money as possible. When they got back to their facility, they realized they were missing more than $20,000. We'll go through your mind, I guess, if you were driving your car down the street or walking down the street and you saw $20,000 everywhere. I think I would stop and get out. Absolutely. Yeah. But you would give the money back? I would. I would. If I lost 20000 and somebody found it, I would hope they'd give it back. We reached out to Brinks for a comment. They did not get back to us. We also went back to the hospital. We could not find any money. Live in Providence with the Mobile Newsroom, Perry Russell, Eyewitness News.